Hi, hello. So recently I've started hyper fixating on alien stage. I think I made a video a while back of me talking about my feelings about alien stage and showing love for it and saying to go watch it. I'm saying again, go watch it. Now that I have gotten like really into the story, I feel comfortable, slightly comfortable doing uh, what your favorite alien stage character says about you. This is my recently played. So first there's Black Sorrow, and then if you go down, there's Unknown, Till's Song, and it, it just keeps, it keeps going. Right off the rip, if you like Alien Stage, you are either queer or queer passing. You either are like, limp wrist, or you can pass as being queer. You give like the fruit vibes, like LGTV vibes, whether you are or you aren't, you know? If I say any of these names wrong, I apologize. I am not good at pronouncing things. Sua, you give big mom friend energy. You give that like overprotective person energy, but in a very like mothering and nurturing type of way. I feel like you give advice a lot to people or people come to you with their problems or with you know, things that they want to talk about. You're like the go-to. Anyways, you're definitely like the more protective person in like a relationship you're in. You give me sophisticated vibes, but in a like dark academia way. Probably love royalty I use or AUs in general. You give me the vibe of like fanfic lover, but also one of the people who really dislikes that there's so little Yuri fix on AO3. And honestly, agreed. You definitely have read Green Yuri, and if you for some, if you somehow haven't read Green Yuri, Google it now and read it. Oh, and you're definitely a Mizzy Sua fan. Mizzy, you're either sapphic or one of those gay twinks who really loves the Sailor Moon aesthetic. You like cute stuff, even if you won't admit it. Like, Till is a Mizzy stan, and I doubt he'd admit that he likes cute stuff, but he probably does. You would love the story in love with the villainess. You give me main character energy, or like the energy, like a bright energy, and this energy that people like flock to. You kind of give me K-pop, J-pop, you know, one of the pops, lover. You have definitely watched Vivinos and um, Q Ming's other videos. Till, you're a softie. Either a Fujoshi or a Fudanshi, one of the two. You're definitely a creative of some type, whether that be writing, art, cosplay, video editing. I feel like you are just a creative person. And like Till, you are a very fiery person and kind of stubborn on certain things. You're like secure in yourself and you know who you are. You listen to punk rock or have at least one time in your life had a punk rock phase. I've been Till fan, definitely. And you have amazing taste. Sundere, you're probably a Sundere. <laughs> If you like Till because you relate to Till, you are a Sundere. You've read more Ivan Till social media you use than you have Bible verses. Ivan, <laughs> I'm reading this. Oh, so you're Fat Yaoi Tron 3968 or whatever the meme is. Probably a masochist, let's be honest. You're a piner, a longer. You love romance or love the idea of companionship with other people. And whether you want to be in a romantic relationship or not, you want a companion throughout life, whether it be platonic, romantic, etc. So you, you want a person, you know what I mean? You want someone who you can go to about your day and talk to and have like an intimate relationship with, but not intimate, not necessarily intimate like sexual, but intimate like you, close, you know what I mean? You probably wear or feel most comfortable in black. I, you're giving me like theater kid vibes or autistic, probably autistic. Or no, no, not autistic per se, neurodivergent. Ivan stands give me neurodivergent. Hyena, I can spell her name, but I cannot say it. It's like Hyena. You like her, you like strong women, but not necessarily strong in like the obvious way of like, you know, strong or strong-willed or stubborn or whatever, like a till kind of strong. You like a strong woman who can take care of herself, whether that be like strength, or like physical strength, attitude, or not, you know? You give off the vibes you would like Vanderwood and Mystic Messenger. You probably would be pretty good at shooter games whether you play them or not. You give me a Tome fan vibes. You definitely had a period as a child or as a teen or something where you went and watched a bunch of shock videos and were traumatized by it. Don't look up shock videos if you are not over the age of 18, but 
if you're if you're her fan, you you probably have had that time in your life. Luca, hello, traumatized husband lovers. Oh my God, you probably like Akechi, Itachi, Sasuke, Giyu, any character that's like traumatized but like pretty. You're gay, but in a homophobic way. You're like if internalized homophobia was externalized. You give me like musical theater kid who was cast in all the shows, whether it be a main character or like a tree, number two. You also give me a royalty vibe, but like a light academia way where it's like bright and angel-esque. You know what I mean? You give me those vibes. L kind of similar to Luca, you give me like a very angelic person or a very like put together person, but underneath that you are probably traumatized and I relate. And then any other secondary character that I did not mention in this, you love details of things. You love details. You love getting into the nitty gritty of things that you interact with. Also, y'all live for the social media AUs where these characters are pulled up from the depths and created and characterized more than they are in the canon. So I'm gonna get going. If I missed a character that you want me to talk about, leave it in the comments below. I will see you next time. Go read my social media AU, my Ivan Till social media AU, or go read my fic, my Ivan Till fic, or go watch the other video I talked about Alien Stage in. I'll probably be back with another Alien Stage video soon. Cause I have, I literally just thought of an idea as I was speaking. So I'll be back. I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.